continuing on with our healthy bodies, I want to tell you a little bit about going to sleep. So this is a story that says Go to Sleep by Melvin and Gilda Berger. And it's really important for you to get enough sleep to keep you healthy. And everyone needs sleep. So look, it's mommies and daddies, aunts and uncles. Everybody needs sleep. It's so important. Your brain works all day. And it says your brain gives off little waves of electricity all day long. So when you're in school, your brain is working, doing problems, reading. So your brain works all the time. Your muscles work all day. And it says your heart is a muscle. So when you're playing, you can play outside, soccer. Anytime you're playing, if you feel your heart beat really fast, that means you're really working up a good sweat. And it helps your body. It keeps your body healthy. Your brain gets tired. Your muscles get tired too. So everybody gets tired. The day is over. So now they're brushing their teeth. It's time to go to bed. Remember, sleeping is so important. Do you read before you go to sleep? Does anybody read to you before you go to sleep? Or do you listen to a story? So they're enjoying a story before they go to sleep. Do you listen to music? Some people go to sleep with music. Or do you cuddle with a toy? So anything you do that helps you sleep. While you sleep, your muscles rest, your heart slows down, your body mends, you grow, you dream, and your brain is hard at work. So this is what it looks like when your brain waves are awake, when you're awake. And your brain moves when you're asleep. So everything's resting and re-energizing itself for the next day. How long do you sleep? Most children need about 10 hours of sleep a night. So that's a lot of sleep. How do you wake up? So if you go to bed early and wake up, at a good time, you might be happy, but sometimes if you don't get enough sleep and you go to bed really late and you have to wake up early for school, then you're kind of cranky. You might be a little grumpy. So you have to make sure you get enough sleep. Sleep 10 hours and you wake up happy. Sleep 10 hours and you're ready to start the day. So look how happy these kids are. They are ready to conquer the day. Too little sleep and you wake up tired. Too little sleep and you're sleepy all day. So some people might fall asleep in the car. Or maybe you're falling asleep when you're watching TV. Maybe you're falling asleep at school. So you've got to make sure you get enough sleep. Too little sleep and you're grumpy all day. She doesn't look happy. Oops, you may also have more accidents says too little sleep makes it hard to think clearly. So you might get hurt a lot if you're not getting a lot of sleep. It says snuggle in. They have their favorite teddy bear. Everyone needs to sleep. Some sleep in funny places. So they fell asleep in a hammock, maybe on the beach. So some sleep in funny positions. So they're sleeping in the bed, but they're all upside down. And they're sleeping on, it looks like the floor maybe, just all curled up. But at night, we all sleep in beds. Zzz, sweet dreams. So some people might not have a bed, so they might sleep on a couch. Or maybe on a blow-up bed, which is fine. But we just need to make sure we all get a good night's sleep so we're healthy and happy the next morning. All right, friends. See you next time. Bye-bye.